I can control when I want to be happy. If I want to go to sleep, I'll take these pills. If I want to be, you know, outgoing and confident, I'm going to take these ones. I used to think that addicts were just the bums on the street in New York or the people shooting up heroin every day. Like, I can be an addict. I'm from the suburbs. Like, I can't do that kind of stuff. A kid living in the crib in the burbs, sheltered by his family, he's a bit of a nerd. His parents have goals for him, they know his purpose on earth. But recently, everything they told him has been kicked to the curb. Why? Word on the street is he started hitting the herb and loves how it felt walking with a bit of a swerve. Why? Weed wasn't enough, he started sipping the syrup, buying rope with us and gathering up his homies at his home. Like, yeah. let me show you something. Creeping up in the attic at his parents' house where he had a television and a couch. So his mother and his father would never have a doubt They never expected weekly he would sniff a half an ounce And XTC pills were popping so much you don't have to count They're just happy he's popular now and never staying out Him and his friends are in his room quote unquote hanging out So oblivious parents don't have a thing to complain about Even though they're having addicts in the attic Crushing tablets as a habit Chewing magic mushrooms using acid Cause somebody had it What happens when it isn't strong enough And they can't hit a bong enough To stay faded for long enough They choose to move along the harder stuff To give the heart a rush They're going through their mama's purse To come up on the farm He's from the pharmacist The result of this is problematic So parents need to be aware of addicts in the attic, 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 attic. I can buy prescriptions for any drug really just as fast as I can buy pizza Maybe just pass me a pill and I can just swallow it without a teacher noticing in class or without my parents noticing because I wouldn't have the smell of marijuana on me. I dropped out of school when I was 16. I lost my childhood. I gained uh, multiple charges. charges, charges, charges. A young man, sun tans, with cuffed hands, stuck with the damn future that the judge plans. After court, will go to his room and huff cans to get buzzed, and then hit up the drug man to get some. Meanwhile, his mother is on a date, leaving a fiend child to suffer another day. But to him and his current state, everything is just fun and games. Plenty of dames coming around, trying to get faced. Hungry for days, spending his lunch money on ways to get blazed. This crib is the best place to get laced. No need to hit raves cause kids stay indoors and parents just ignore the fact that shit face there's no force shown maybe they should change that and enforce a no closed doors home to keep the kids from getting inebriated parents are the reason that these kids don't feel the need to make it so they turn to fiends and start to be creative with the schemes that seem to go unnoticed easily evaded a model teen turns into a problem child that needs an intervention cause all he seems to be is faded but his parents don't don't seem to see that he is wasted They're in the basement He's in the attic as a base head With his face red Overdosing off his anti sober potion And his folks won't notice till he's straight dead So I've talked with a lot of parents before And a lot of them are in denial about their kids using When I was the one using with their kid I think that to keep their kids safer I would tell parents to throw away their prescriptions When they're done with them And just to be more aware of which drugs can be abused just be more aware of the medication in general. I wish we could have talked a lot more. I wish I could have actually reached out to them and been like, hey, like, I feel really scared at school. You know, I feel a lot of my friends are pressuring me. I know for me, when I talked about using drugs with my parents more, I would feel guilty when I was using because I didn't want to lie to them. If you really feel the need to, then, you know, search your kids for it. Uh, don't be afraid to ask them, hey, are you getting high or have you gotten high? Or, you know, do you have drugs? Do you know anybody who gets high? Don't be afraid to ask those questions because how else are you going to expect to figure out if your kid's using or not? Or not, or not, or not, or not.